Right, so level par, heading onto course A. Yeah. Um, kicking off with a par five, so we could even go on to par pretty quickly if yeah. we get do things right here. I think so. Yeah. Nice little cut down the middle. That could be absolutely perfect, could it not? Well, that's, yep, yeah, spot on. I think the less said about that, the better. Oh my God, there's the thin bullet, sorry. I like that. She's not needed. I've been <laughs> three shots and not he's rolled in the pool. Not needed, 99% of the hole previous to that putt. <laughs> right. Three on the spin. Three on the spin. Pound me. Right guys, welcome back. The back nine or the A course here at La Quinta in the Costa del Sol in Spain. Back with Sophie Walker, of course. We're playing two man or two person. Sorry, that's very sexist of me. Texas scramble. <laughs> and to be honest with you, in part one, if you've seen it, you'll know we didn't go off to a flying start. And we were two over, three, four, so not our best stuff. No, but things are getting better. And I can promise you part two will be a lot better than part Well, one. you called it when we were coming towards the end of the front nine, you said, that's barely the last two, finish level five, get going on back nine. And we have got off to a birdie start on our first hole. So three in a row in the, in the game, we're here to one under par gross, slightly more respectable. Let's see if we can get a little bit deeper. But as I did in part one, if you want to jump into the comment section and guess what you think our final score will be, we don't know if we're going to play 18 holes, pop into the comment section down below and join in, ridicule us by going over par, have some faith by going level, and maybe be a bit optimistic by posting an under par score. Right, so short par four, big water hazard and kind of a cliff face type thing, really cool looking hole. Three in a row, one under par gross. I'm not hitting driver because I'll hit, I'll reach the water. You can plonk one down there and yeah. be, I guess, right up to the water's edge really, won't you be? I think it is to the right, isn't it, this dot? So yeah, I'm just yeah the green's kind around. of, yeah. In terms of where the camera's looking, the green is kind of over here. So your kind of right side of the fairway type thoughts? Yeah. yeah. I'm just going to try and plonk a two iron down there. Spot on, isn't it? I think so. Yep, nice shot. Yeah, it's just how far you dare take it to the right. That's lovely. I think that's, well, very similar line to mine, but with a bit of chase. Yeah. Very good. Kind of position, eh? On the A course. <laughs> right, I said position A off the tee. Decent shot, but cheeky little tree, which isn't really in the way, but it, it kind of is, for me at, le at least, making me think a bit. Yeah, I mean, any further right, and it, it would be in trouble. Yeah, I um, don't think you can come to Spain and not have a tree in the middle of the fair. <laughs> <laughs> um, what was the yardage, so? 110. 110, obviously big water hazard staring at us, big bunker on the right, so... Personally, I'm looking middle of the green. I'm guessing Soph is going to be braver if, if I do hit the middle of the green, especially. Yeah, let's um, see. 110. Don't fat it in the water. That's such a big pull. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's a par, I think, but... Where is it? Uh, just left of the left fringe. Oh, is it's it? Kind of distance. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah, that was a proper pull. Is that tree in your head or? No, I'm just rubbish. Okay. Oh, just towed it, it's fine. It's not great, it's on the green. It's on the green. Expecting 
Sophie to do better. No, set. Pa. Good hole. Strong par four. Back Lovely, into the breeze. 440 yards. Good hit required, really. The right, oh, the right bit high, but that's better than anything I can do, so I'm going to have a rest on this tee shot. <laughs> Fair enough. And cut a bit. And kick right, and that's good, I reckon. Yeah, it's a nice shot. Yeah, that's good. Take it's what, 20 feet? Yeah. No, maybe not. It's just on the edge of the green, I think. But it's it's good with a fairway wood. Well, just for optimist. optimism's sake, I'll hit one. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. should be doing what you did off the tee and just having a rest, because I don't think I'm getting closer than that. But that was a very nice shot. Hang on a minute. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's going to be close between those two. <laughs> right, we'll get to the approach shots in a minute, but Sophie's just very kindly pointed out that traffic sign there, which is the, uh, the elusive junction. 172. If you 172. miss it, you go on the toll, you go 20 minutes that way, and you have to come all the way back. Yeah. Um, I tell you what, don't miss it twice though, because that's really <laughs> not great, is but it? it is, now that you point out, it's very, it's quite painful actually, that it's literally 50 feet from yeah, the golf course. I didn't dare tell you that when I was looking at the Google Maps thinking, but in the car, no, I'll just stay quiet. So it's your fault then. <laughs> so I think I've just edged you, have I? I don't know. Good shots. Two very good shots. One slightly long, one slightly short. Stop kicking the tripod, Rory. I don't know who is closer, but I'm uphill, I guess. Yeah, I think you've probably got the nicer foot. Mine's a little bit left to right. So. Cool. Any little opportunity I get to uh, contribute, even though it makes no difference between those two parts, I will grab it with both hands. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> We're still people. in this. That's like the hardest hole in the course as well. 440, par 4, Bosch. Two under. In. That's that's decent through the last five holes, isn't it? Yeah, we've come alive. <laughs> Do you know what I think it was? I think missing that sign, it really put a Debbie Downer on those first six holes. Well, yeah, my brain was spinning, but like thinking how much <laughs> she was driving like this. <laughs> Right guys, four birdies in five holes. We're really cooking now. Uh, two under par grow. So anyone who wants to revise their guess, feel free to jump into the comment section again. Are we gonna finish under par? I do think we've got a good chance for it. You know, we were really low on energy those first few holes. It's been a long couple of days, but yeah, they're missing the turn off thing. My bad. Yeah, let's keep this energy going. See if we can rattle off a few more. This is gonna be a tough one. It's only a short par three, but you know, they do require good iron shots. So get off here with a par and then start looking maybe towards another par five somewhere on the course and might even finish three or four under so. Look what I've become, Rory's caddy. Yeah, that's why I invited you. Decent, but certainly not your best. But par and move on, I think. But we could roll in a long one. We're due. We are due. Actually, we just hold one, didn't we? Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> Shut up, Rory. Up. <laughs> Still, you'd rate that as a safe, safe. decent-ish putt. So, out there with a the par and moving on. Okay. Cut. Yeah. 
fairway? No, it's, for, it's semi rough, but it'll be fine there. Yeah. Let's move on. <laughs> 187 is a tiny bit into, isn't it? Shouldn't be. Um, I've got an, I do have an extra club, but I don't think it's enough to get into that back bunker. Semi rough, actually sitting quite nicely. Over. Wow. Is that on or is that short? So yeah, not the most inspiring shot for me there. I didn't think it was going to be that far short to be honest with you. But when you look at the strike mark on the face, it was pretty high from centre. So, is that your longest hybrid, yeah? Yeah. So if Sophie can get one kind of moving forwards out of this, you can run it right up to the pin high, can't you? Ooh, it's drifting yeah, right a bit. Get past that bunker. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's a long way, isn't it? It's really dark. Yeah. <laughs> that is uh, back to uh, early front nine yeah. kind of standards. I don't think we just judged it right. Yeah. Right, sadly, we're going to have to use my shot, but actually it's not quite as short as I first thought. Um, walking up onto the green, you get an idea. It's actually a fairly straightforward chip. Uh, well, it will be for Sophie, hopefully. So, um, kind of got 30 feet or so after about five yards of carry up onto the green. And I guess if Sophie hits a good one, I don't have to chip. Well, I suppose I should probably go just in case I chip one in. Stranger things have happened. Yeah, we were both just getting that shot totally wrong, really. Uh, I guess if I'd hit mine out of the middle, it would have been right side, maybe pin eye. So, so if you chuck that one up nicely to, yeah, six feet. Pretty poor as well. Right, after getting all brave and saying we might get three or four under, we're staring par saves in the face again. Um, come on, Sophie, roll it in. Yes. Oh, that's all right. Yes, please. You thought you'd miss that, eh? Oh, I thought I'd left it short. <laughs> nah, that was nah. never short. Stayed at two. Okay. And that's the target, okay. well, what was the target? Did we set ourselves I think one on this? Let's try and get, we've got four left. Let's see if we can uh... get to three at least. Oh, no. No, I'm thinking we get to four. Okay. Easy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Easy. Oh, Brush right. the shoulder off. Come on. <laughs> I said we were going to make some birdies coming in. I didn't look at the scorecard. 202 yards, par <laughs> three. Rory doesn't have a club for this. Nope. My four iron is thoroughly banjaxed. So I'm going to try and like aim up the right and sling one, maybe take a bit of loft off. Two irons are way too much for this and this isn't really enough. Golf shot, Rory. Get up. Go! I think that's as far as I can hit it to five iron. I reckon that might just be front edge, I don't know. Downwind, I have to say, it might help you as such. And you got the three hybrid again? I've got the three wood, because I'm thinking oh. I'm going to try and get it there. I know you said you're going to be short, so I'm going to try and get something up there. Oh, get again. a kick off the Are kick off that to the left. Go on. No. Not everything. Yeah, it's fine. It's front edge. Yeah. I mean, this is a good hole just to get a par and get out. It of is. It. Yeah. That's a tough pin. Yeah. It's what? What's the regulation? Does it have to be four feet from the edge? Is that it? There isn't. A, there isn't. It's a myth. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's kind of a. Just an unwritten. An unwritten rule. Which doesn't have to be obeyed. Three three yards, I think, is. So that's using all of the green, isn't it? This one. Yeah. Three yards is, is kind of, if it's anything less than that, it's a bit naughty. Good read, Rose. Pin high. Pace wasn't disgraceful, that is not a good read. Um, that should be the par, but I'm hoping you roll it up to gimme range. 
Right, it's a soft goat. Should be getting it inside that, I would imagine. Needs to go a bit. Yeah, a little bit closer. Neither of us have covered ourselves in glory there. Finish it off, so. Yeah, well done. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. Take a part now. That's a hard hole today. Hopefully, there'll be easier ones. Yeah, par five, please. Right, while we're in Texas scramble mode, quick question for you guys. What's the lowest ever Texas scramble score you scored? Obviously, we're probably talking four balls here. Yeah, pop us in the comment section, let me know. What's the lowest you scored? I've been part of a group that went 14 under growth. And on the day, we had a pretty low team handicap. We didn't even get in the top three. So um, I'm pretty proud of that score, but I'm pretty sad about the result. Right, so the whole measure is about 310 yards. I've come up maybe 20 short, quite happy with that kind of all carry really actually it's a good hit um pin is 15 feet on not an easy shot but uh, birdie chance i reckon yeah i think so better than it being at the back yeah 33 yards uphill quite hard to gauge the distance that's why i just paced it out because when it's uphill you can't see the bottom of the flag Gravy this, so. Yeah, I just saw by that practice swing. Yeah. <laughs> stop, stop. Got a big kick left there. Yeah. I mean, if I threw it too far as well, but even for me, I'm actually quite happy with that. <laughs> All right, I pitched that a couple of yards past the hole, and it was a bit of a chunky strike, so not much stop on it. I'm not disgusted with it with my level of pitching. But I would expect so to get closer. Get this inside 10 feet, I reckon we're green light for the birdie, the two of us putting. And that's nipped. Stop, stop, stop. Oh! oh, 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 oh. Wow. That was close to actually going in. About two inches left, and that would have had a little chance, but that was a good shot, I would say. I mean, a little bit left to right? Yeah, that's what I was kind of thinking. Yep, yep, yep. Yes, Sophie. Yes. Okay. Three Two under. left. Three under. Oh. We said four. Well, I said four. <laughs> I said on. three, so we've already got a mic on. <laughs> <laughs> That's one box ticked. <laughs> Gotta be another par five, surely. Par three, one, four, five. I reckon this is one of the nicest ones we've played so far. I do. Palm trees, mountains. Water, sure. Well, you've said <laughs> that, not me. Um, yeah, it's nine beautiful. iron. Yeah. Postcard stuff. Nine iron. Good shot required. Can we birdie the last two again? A bit heavy, so it's good right. shot, though, isn't it? It's all right. Maybe I'm so bad with my hands at the moment, I don't even know when I hit a good shot. <laughs> Go in. Oh, oh ho, ho, ho. straight down it. I thought that was better than that. I like our chances though. I like our chances. I do love the call as well. Go in. <laughs> I suppose I did say that yesterday with a three wood actually, so maybe yeah, I yeah. should shut up. <laughs> okay, so I was a little bit ambitious with the going call. It was the perfect line, but it's what? 20, 20 feet short. Maybe I'm a bit tired. We're always going to save the day though here with a birdie too. We We've been pretty average on the par threes yeah. this trip, so. 
I think we can class those as two good shots though. Yeah. Slightly less pace that's in, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> what was your line? Just hit it up the right, like maybe ball outside. Just less pace. Yes, please. Put me down under. for a two. <laughs> yes, lovely. Four under with a five to finish. Come on, five under, we can do this. Well, 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 who would have thought it? Minus four stood on the 18th. Yeah. Tough finisher, 480, up the hill. Up the mountain, yeah, it's got to be well over 500, right? Yeah. Do me a favor, Rory, hit a good one. Okay. Money. Get Ooh. up. Uh, wow, yeah. that's on the top shelf. I would Thank not be God. able to get anywhere near that. Great shot. Thank you. I knew there was a reason you came. <laughs> Apart from working for the company that, you know. <laughs> right, so 250. So I'm going to have to absolutely murder a three yeah. to get there, I think. I'm just going to coax one down there so we're hopefully in play and then you can have a dig. Yeah, it's a bit of a funny one. So you guys watching on camera, the pin is around here. It's like two levels to this fairway. Yeah, that's a really good hit, isn't it? That's a good hit, yeah. I don't know if it's a bit left. It is up the left, but I think it will camber down, down and I think it's fine. You it's a good, good shot. There, come on, having it one... Well, I don't, know, I don't really pay attention to myself, do I? I was like, I haven't hit a good three off the deck for a while. It's like I hit the best shot I've hit in about a year yeah, yesterday. Just do that again. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Oh, just no! Sweet. Half ball. Oh, be right at that path. Oh, just. It's, good shot, that it's so close to being pretty good, isn't it? It's like just a bit of turn. Bit of a shame that, Rory, because you'd have easily have reached, wouldn't you? Yeah, I mean, it was. It's kind of ten just. 10 yards right, I was yeah. kind of trying to. It's gone down there on the right, but. And the the good, path the good and the road is quite close. Yeah, I mean that's definitely just still trickling down that hill on the You'll road. Probably pick it up on the way back to the clubhouse. Yeah, yeah like the one, the good one I hit yesterday had a touch of draw, didn't it? And I was thinking yeah. I might do the same thing, but oh well, yours is a good shot as well. Let's make birdie the old-fashioned way. Yeah, I'm actually just going to try and chuck one in a bit lower than I have been. Okay. Seeing as all the rest of my pictures have been basically useless. Chip and run. Maybe try a different path. Horrendous, Not horrendous, no. A little bit left and it was a decent shot for me. <laughs> right, so so you've got more loft, I presume? Yeah, 58. Just trying to feel one in there. <laughs> oh, Rory, Rory, Rory. That was tired. <laughs> Should we just How often hold? I say this. Should, should we just we hold? Yours pitch? Should we just? Should we just hold one of those and go back and have yeah. a have a beer maybe? Oh, did it mix anyone? <laughs> right, guys. Note the date down in your diaries. We're taking a Rory Anderson pitch, which actually isn't that bad. Now we get up here. It's like I said. If that was at the pin, you'd be you'd be letting. Oh yeah, six foot. Good shot, Ross. As it happens, we are about twelve to fifteen feet, putting through a tiny bit of fairway, really. Um, hold one of these for minus five and beat our target, so. Did I get closer on the last two parts of it without holding one? I mean, I was going at pace it was going to hit, but. Yeah, it, I thought it was good. That was yeah. good. Right, so last chance saloon for five under. Yeah. You know the line, it does swing a bit. 
But I think we're good for the par, so you can give it a good bosh if you want to. Not to be. Oh. Four under is quite good after the start, I would yeah, say. Yeah, it is. I just can't believe I'm disappointed in four under after <laughs> that first five holes. We probably should try and hold this just to validate the four under, yeah, but yeah. Um, I don't see both of us missing that one. Let's validate. <laughs> Right, four under, lovely golf course. Um, I think we'll finish the video probably at the bar. Yeah. Maybe after a shower and a bit of a check in as well. Shall we? Yeah. Right, see you at the bar. Let's go to the bar. Right, guys, just got into my hotel room, and as you can see, it's pretty damn nice. What is it so? No. <laughs> it's not too bad, is it? <laughs> I might get up early and take a dip in that actually. Right guys, just arrived in the restaurant downstairs here at Westland Kinta and what a setting. I'm not gonna spin the camera around. Lots of paying guests here, you don't need this shoved in their face. Yeah, right beside the pool, I'm guessing this is gonna be the heart of the resort during the day. Uh, I think what's I don't know what cheers is in Spanish, so so we'll just go for an old-fashioned English one. Cheers. <laughs> know what you're having from the menu yet? Ah. I'm going sea bass. Mediterranean vegetables and some french fries. And anyone who watches any of the videos on this channel will know I'm going to go for steak, peppercorn sauce and chips. Some things never change. Right, all done. Day two finished here at the Costa del Sol. Um, Western La Quinta this afternoon, La Cala this morning. If you already heard our thoughts on Carla, Western La Quinta, honestly the hotel was absolutely fantastic. Just had an amazing meal. I had a lovely steak. Sophie had some pretty awesome sea bass. And yeah, I'm so ready to hit the sack, I can't tell you. It's been a long one. Tomorrow we've got even more incredible golf courses lined up. So if you want to see more of the Costa del Sol, see what the best the Costa del Sol has to offer, make sure you stay tuned. But right now, it's time for bed. Thank you for watching day two of our Costa del Sol tour. Everything continues tomorrow, but right now, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Do the comments, hit the like button, and I'll see you tomorrow. Oh.